Hi guys, welcome to the short video about the question what's the best cheap smartwatch or maybe let's better call it best budget smartwatch for swimming. I think this could be a really good option. I mean, it's not super cheap, but we can always get it for around $50 on Amazon. If you're interested, I'll put down the link into the description. I think the listing price of $79 is just like a fake or so. It's always around $50 as far as I've seen. It's available in three different colors. I've made a full review about the black one and I really liked it. I know there are watches which look fancier than this one here, but the design is definitely a little bit of an understatement, I would say. But I've realized that a lot of functions are really, really well integrated in this watch much better than with some other smart watches. It's waterproof IP68, so it's not 30 meter, 50 meter, 100 meter, but uh, you never know. I mean, I would never trust like a 100 meter waterproof rating in such a smart watch. And IP68 is definitely enough for normal swimming, but of course I wouldn't go diving with such a watch. But why do I think it's a really nice smart watch for swimming? And this is because I've made this waterproof test with the swim option. I mean, it has more than 100 sports option and I hope you can see that. I was showing it under the running water. I stopped this here again. Maybe I go a little bit further. Yeah, maybe we can see that here. Yeah, I think here in this area we can see it displays a lock icon. When you look very closely, you can see that sometimes that it has this lock icon here, this green lock. And what it means is that the screen doesn't move at all. It's somehow deactivated in this specific swimming mode. The display is still turned on, but it doesn't move. It doesn't do any crazy stuff. When you do the same thing with other smartwatches, and I mean, I've tested a lot of them, and with 99% of all the smartwatches, when you go into swim mode and you hold it under running water, then the smartwatch starts doing crazy stuff and that's not happening here. So that's an awesome thing and maybe I can show you what you have to do at the very end to stop it. Of course that also means that you cannot stop the swim tracking just with a touch here. Of course you have to use then the button on the right side but that's exactly what we want. Of course again I'm here not talking about expensive $300 or more smart watches like the Apple Watch or Android Wear watches, which of course have exactly the same functions and even better. But here I'm talking about smart watches in a price range of usually $50, maybe up to $100. And what you have to do usually with these watches, you can start the swim mode, but you have to deactivate the wrist gesture or touch to wake and then the display will be off and you won't see anything, no calories, no timing, no nothing. So this is definitely much, much better here. Yeah, here in this video, you can also see that also when you touch the watch here, the display, it's absolutely not doing anything. And you can see here the lock even better. So the display is definitely locked. And so the only thing what you can do is to push long on the right side to stop. And what's also awesome is that it will then drain the water after that. There could be water in the speaker. Of course, you have to shake out the remainders, but that's definitely an awesome thing. So I stopped this here again. Of course, no live demonstration, but this is uh, from the recording what I have done for the full review. If you're interested in the full review, I'll put down the link to the full review down into the description of the video and also the link to the Amazon listing where you can buy it. And so I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments or if you have found a better watch for swimming, then just let us know down in the feedback area. I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.